Hi everybody, it's Wanda. I've been wanting to do a blue textured metallic using the blow dryer and see what I get. And I need five ounces of paint for this because this is a 12 by 12. This is a five ounce cup. I have, I believe this is I believe this is some Anita's white and some cobalt blue that I lightened. And this is some that's even darker. That's the same thing. I don't know how I made that one. And this one is Anita's Blue Lagoon, which is really pretty, pretty color. And totally different than the other two as far as blue. Uh, it's more of like an aqua, deep, deep aqua. So since I have a lot of this, I'm gonna start out with some of that. Add some of this and see if it's a little darker. May not be, may be the same thing. It's a little bit darker. And I need a little variation in the shades. That one is kind of ucky. I'm not sure I like that one. So I may not even use it next time. Forgot to turn my other lamps on, so I don't know if you all can see that much or not. Maybe in the shadow there. We'll put all of that pretty blue lagoon in there. Push that over to the side, because I don't like it. I don't like it, so I'm not gonna use it. This should give it some variation. I think that'll work. I think I usually do this as a flip cup. It's been a while now since I did one of these, but I think I'm just gonna pour it. I am using the blow dryer on it, so shouldn't matter a whole lot how it comes out of the cup. Oops, pulled out my pen. That is not good. I don't know if I can get that back in there or not. <clears throat>
Okay. Now, see if I can get that pin back up in there. A little push pin. I think I got it. Can't wait to see how this turns out. I will mute the blow dryer. End up having to put it on high to get it to move good that last little bit. Ooh, I think this is going to be so pretty. Oh, wow. That um, Blue Lagoon is really gorgeous, and it's showing up and giving it just the right amount of contrast in there. I love this. I can't wait to think of something really pretty to put on top of that. Could be a transfer. Could be a painting of some type. I might think of something that I want to paint on top of it. I really haven't thought of anything. I might do just do a hot air balloon. I've been wanting to do a hot air balloon for a long time and haven't gotten around to doing that. And this kind of looks like sky. So that might work. So thank you so much for watching. I'm going to take the camera down now and give you all a close-up. I love these. I don't know if anybody else loves these or not, but I certainly do. Who would think that you could get so much movement out of just three or four colors in the same family? I mean, they're all blue, but I can't wait till it dries. See how it dries. It's funny because these look like they're going to be, you know, all over the place with texture, but they really dry completely flat because the paint levels out so well. But I do like this. I think it's cool. So, tell me what you all think. Of course, the dried one will be at the end of the video. So, thanks for watching.